Hello guys, how's it going? It's Tifty here and welcome to my channel and thank you so much for all your support. Thank you for liking my videos, for commenting on my videos and for turning up to watch them. I don't thank you guys enough. So I just wanted to start off on that positive note. Also, if you haven't already, join my Discord. All the memes, we're all very friendly. Come along, have a chat, ask me stuff, do whatever you like. And finally, I would love it if you came along to one of my streams. I'm really enjoying streaming. I limit them to two hours. I put loads of effort in, stay really enthusiastic, and I think they're really good. Top-notch entertainment, if I do say so myself. So yeah, feel free to come along and say hi later today, if I'm releasing this on a Friday or on a Saturday at 4 p.m. Okay, enough of that. Let's have a little look at the medic. Now, first of all, I'm not very good at medic, so you're going to see some footage in the background. Go easy on me. But yeah, today we're going to be looking at three awesome, spectacular, beautiful new weapon concepts for the medic. Now, I'm hoping they're new. There are loads of weapon concept videos out there. So if any of these have been kind of talked about before, or they're very similar to previous weapon ideas that other YouTubers have talked about, apologies. I did a bit of research, but you know, there's quite a lot out there, so I didn't want to watch every single video. But yeah, some of these may have been done before. Feel free to let me know in the comments below. And as I always say at the beginning of these videos, I don't necessarily think that Medic needs a ton of new weapons. I just think this is really fun to do. And I just love sharing my ideas with you guys and then getting your feedback as always, I don't really go into much of the details and into the stats, into the numbers. Um, you guys always comment below and that's awesome. And you can let me know which ones are ridiculously OP, which ones would break the game and which ones would be the best thing ever. The only thing that I reckon the medic really needs is an alternative to his crossbow because his crossbow is awesome and so the needle gun never sees the light of day. So maybe there should be a tweak to the needle gun and maybe there should be something else in his repertoire that he can whip out to mix up his gameplay a little bit. Right then, concept number one, the Protonic Reverser. Ooh. I do enjoy making up names for these weapons, but I also love hearing your suggestions in the comments below. So what is this thing? It's a split beam medigun, and it heals up to three targets at once. I know. Now, this was the one that I was most worried about in terms of someone must have come up with this before. You know, it's a pretty standard idea, really. But I quite like the idea of being able to heal multiple targets at a slower rate and I think you could do some really interesting things with how the Uber works. So the idea was that, you know, it takes longer to heal each target, but obviously you can do three at once. And it also takes longer to build an Uber. But once you do build an Uber, it packs perhaps a slightly more of a punch if you can coordinate it with several teammates. So you can Uber three targets for a reduced amount of time in addition, there could be a Kritzkrieg version which grants mini crits to three players. That would be very cool. Me thinks. So, I'm never great at figuring out if something would break the game, and this could be one of those things. But the idea is that if you're using it as a regular medigun with a disorganized team who aren't sticking together, you're just going to end up healing people more slowly and with an uber that doesn't last as long. But if you can coordinate your team, you can heal loads of people at once as they're stacking the point or what have you, and then when they all push together, you can pack quite a punch, ubering three scouts at the exact same time as you charge in and demolish the entire enemy team. Maybe five seconds is too long, I'm not sure. I really liked the mini crit equivalent, so maybe it would make more sense to have it instead of be invulnerable, you just get some buff. I don't know, there are other mediguns already like that, so I kind of wanted to try and avoid that feature. My only one concern with this is, obviously these beams would have to kind of lock onto your teammates automatically a little bit, in which case would it make playing medic a little bit more boring? I wouldn't want to dumb down the medic gameplay if you see what I mean. Anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comments below and let me know how this weapon could be balanced. Concept number two, the beta blocker. Now this may be my finest piece of work. This name I am so chuffed with and let me explain why. This is an alternative to the needle gun and the crossbow that on hit it slows the target for a small duration of time. But because obviously you're hopefully hitting the target a lot of times, it slows them for a longer period of time, if you see what I mean. The idea behind this weapon is that your whole team dies, you need to escape back to spawn, you're being chased by a scout, you get the beta blocker out and you slow him down and you make it out alive and you avoid being beaten. It's genius because it's also like a drug and stuff, I know. 
I was also thinking, you know, perhaps if you get a lot of hits in a row, it rewards you with actually putting the target to sleep for a very short period of time. Again, these figures are kind of finger in the air figures. And the downside would be that it has a significant reduction in damage and clip size. So yeah, it's not about doing damage, it's just about slowing those pursuing enemies and getting you back out there to conserve your uber charge perhaps for the next fight. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I think my only concern for this one is obviously slowing and being put to sleep. Not the most satisfying mechanics for the victim. But, you know, it works in other games, it could work here too. As a side note, I was wondering should there be kind of a needle gun that heals? So it heals tiny amounts and you can sort of spam it in. Exactly the same as the crossbow, you know, if you shoot the enemy it hurts them, if you shoot your team it heals them, but it just has a fast rate of fire. Could be an interesting alternative, I'm not sure. Okay, concept number three, the amplifier. The name probably could be better here, but I was trying to play with the name amputator and you'll see why in just a second. So this is a backpack that takes up the primary slot for the medic and provides area of effect healing. Jesus Christ, Tifty, stop breaking the game. I know, I'm sorry. This one's a little bit mental. The idea being that it allows the user to play as the battle medic using their secondary as their primary. So either the crossbow or the needle gun. So yeah, you wouldn't get out a medigun at all. That's all done automatically, but it's obviously done at a much reduced rate. And maybe you just don't get Ubers at all. <laughs> Thoughts? Obviously at a high level, that would never get used in competitive TF2. But in a pub, that would be kind of ideal. It would encourage people to play Medic. It would make him potentially more fun because you can go around doing damage and yet you can still kind of heal slowly the team around you. In terms of the actual image there, I was thinking it could look a bit like a dispenser, you know, strapped to a medic's back. Or I was thinking, you know, the amputator taunt where he plays it like a violin. Somehow there's some machine in a backpack that's constantly playing these amputators and it's kind of healing everybody around. Okay, nope. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, I like to end on a few bonus concepts that are a little bit more mental. I think some of these may have legs, but I didn't put a lot of thought into them. So, what if you could summon Archimedes? Now that would be cool. I'm not sure what it does yet. Does it attack the enemy? Does it provide healing to everyone around you? I don't know, but it could look like this little bird here. Beautiful drawing, Tifty. Or what if you had a heart and when you hit people, you collected beats? Again, literally just a pun and I worked with it and I haven't put any more thought in than that. What about the classic crossbow or something similar that administers poison? Poison is quite an annoying game mechanic, but the idea is that, you know, you hit the enemy, they have a kind of bleeding effect or whatever, and as soon as they go near a teammate, they pass on that disease or that poison or what have you. It would probably be quite gimmicky and um, it probably wouldn't work, but you know, it kind of fits the idea of the medic administering poison. And finally, Again, they're all very well themed. What about an x-ray thing, gun, I don't know, that shows skeletons through the walls to the medic so he can see where the enemy is. It's perfect. There is nothing wrong with this weapon idea. I don't want to hear another word from you, okay? Anyway, that's my three weapon ideas. Always lots of fun doing this series and I always seem to get a great response from you guys. So let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.